this is how we do it. Oh. Hi guys, and this is Miss Match Blossom. And today I've got another Han Fu unboxing. So today I just wanted to show you guys what I have. I'm not gonna show you the front because it has my address on it. This one is gonna be a little different than traditional Han Fu's, either from any dynasty. I'm just gonna let you know that now. The reason why I got this one is because for some reason I've been watching too much Princess Agents and Princess Wei Young. It's the other one I just recently saw. I'm trying to think. Hold on, give me some. It's like something castle, Novaland castle. I'm sorry, I'll just put... So when I got this in the mail, I was like, she ready? This outfit, I'm just gonna let you guys know off the top. It's not a traditional hanfu. It's not a traditional hanfu. Okay? Thanks. So this one, if I'm correct, it should be one of the dancer outfits that you would see called a like a hanfu dancers outfit but like they have it for couples like that are this signature so i'll try to if i have the time i'll put a picture somewhere up here i'm excited for this not as excited as my neighbors having sex right now making lots of noise but still yes let it rip baby ah oh, man that hurt my finger okay i'm just gonna open it Ooh, let's give it a look oh wait okay hold on Okay, so I think that's the box. Because they came in different interchangeable clothes. I mean, colors, hot colors. Ooh, look at that. It came with the whole set. And they give me another Hyunden again. Hyunden? Hyunden. Someone correct me in the comments. Please, I'm tired of butchering, okay? Thank you. So they give me another like floral tattoo that goes right here. I just keep them just in case because I don't really need it right now. But look at that, it comes with the wrist. The wrist guards, the hair accessories, and another damn ribbon. If you guys have seen my other videos, I don't know why they keep giving me ribbons, but we, we just gonna take it, okay? We just gonna take it. Ooh, I was gonna say a dirty joke. Let me stop. So let's go ahead and get this open. By the way, I do want to say this because I was looking at more Han food to do more of these videos. I don't know if you guys noticed this, but there are some actual brands out there and different sellers that do sell it in extra, extra large. So for people who think, oh, it's just because you're curvy in a skinny way, they actually sell them for extra, extra large. I know that's not like a lot for still people who are plus size, but I'm going to try to see if there is a plus size line for people. It doesn't matter what race you are. If you're plus size, you're plus size. It don't map, fam. You've still got this, okay? All right, so let's get this open. Now remember, I'm going to wash this in cold water and, and hang it dry before I show you what it looks like on me. Just thought I'd let you know. Now I did order a sword to go with this because I don't know, I'm telling you, I've been seeing too many Princess Agent. So the accessories come separately, but we'll go over that at the end. Oh, look at this shirt. Ah! Oh, I'm so excited. I want to buy more from the seller. All right, so here's the shirt. Oh my gosh. Oh, look at that embroidery. Okay, I know it's generic. Okay, don't judge me. I like embroidery, okay, because I can't do it. All right. So, like every other Hanfu, ooh, girl, uh-uh. Okay, here's some pros and cons. Why we got some threading right here? Can you see that? There's already threading hanging. Hanging like an X that will not leave you alone. Okay, why, ooh, hello. I'm a seamstress, it's fine, but we'll fix it later, it's fine. So, right here, if you guys can see, and if you guys do not know about Hanfu, some people might, and there's also threading in the back, there's also a little. The middle part of the back actually symbolizes righteousness and um you know being balanced because if you don't have you don't have righteousness and i like how also they not only have the red designs on the shirt i wish they had a little bit more color detail inside of it that would make it more like glamorous already besides it looking basic then they also have like this silverish gold kind of metallic design on the other side of the right sleeve i forgot which dynasty it is it's it's gonna click in my head later they do have tassels where it leans over to the left side and then comes over to the right side there is a meaning behind it where they all actually have the outside folded to the right left and i'm gonna actually put in 5,000 years this video where she explains it I like it being that thin but it's because it looks too costumey for me it looks too much like a costume i'm used to making thicker ones or like you know more thicker than this it just looked like a shoe tie lace you know what i'm saying it is pretty long it's pretty long um this is the best way i can sign it just design it this is the best way i could see it it's a contrast it's a color contrast han food but let's go ahead and start on the bottom now the bottom is just solid black from what i'm seeing oh wait hold on okay so hmm 
of the bottoms. And there is a hole that you put it, like you wrap it around your body and then you put uh, a loop through your waist and then you put it around your body and you tie it again. So what I mean by that is that you wrap it around your body, you have one end that's not being touched, that's not in the inside. The other one is, one's on the outside, and then you put one through here. Hopefully, like I said, I will, I'll link another one of her videos because she does it really great. So it comes as one whole piece, if that makes sense. This part does not come with, this, this does not come with any designs. It is plainer than my hair color. It's like twinsies. Now, I feel like they should have designs on it, but at the same time, if you're kind of like an slash, assassin slash dancer like this, I guess you want to blend in, but still look like you belong in that dynasty. I'll see how I like it, but let's go ahead and go to the accessories since I don't see any loose threads on the bottom. I think they were just rushing the top. If you guys may know, there is a noise in the background, and that is a fan. It is July 6th. It is hot as heck in this apartment. I just want to let you guys know that because also I'm like sweating sitting here. These are the accessories. Um, I think it comes with this little thing for the, the wrist cuffs, but let me see if I can put it together. Side note, wrist cuffs are pretty cool. I just want to say that before I put them on. They have contradictory cranes and they're actually embroidered with like fake pleather. And then on the inside, it's a nice satin fabric. That's pretty cool for 34 bucks. I got this whole thing. Really nice. I'll try to link the, it in the description if I can. I don't know what I'm doing with this, so we're just gonna take a minute, guys. God, she looks so awesome. Can I say this? Look at that. Oh, look at that, look at that. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing. This really doesn't help me. Um, Ta-da! I did it! Okay, I'm gonna show you exactly what I did. So, because I had to figure it out. It's like doing your shoes, in a way. If you don't know how to do your shoes, fine. Big Sister Blossom is here, okay? What I did first was I put this little string, because I'm using the back, okay? This is the front, this is the back. I took the string from one end and poked it through here. Don't worry about the equivalence. It'll get fixed later, I promise. And you take this other half that you have, and you put it though here. So I did it like this at first, right? And then you start crisscrossing across. So you know this is in the front, you scoot it over to go like this. This part through the opposing side or the perpendicular side if you really want to get technical. So it looks like this. But I just moved it over like this because when I wear it, it'll auto adjust itself. So then you do this and then you do the same thing on the other end. From already when I tightened it because it was not even on both sides, when I tightened it to make it more, you see how the wrist cuff is shaping out? Now that I've looped it on the other side, all you have to do is loop this over here. So now you have your voice uh, wrist cuff. And now you're just gonna put this through. This is a I'm not gonna lie, this one's a little toughy. Because the way that they made this, this is one thing I don't like. It's like bent. Do you see that weird angle? It's bent all funny. So, I gotta bend it back. It's still not bending right. So, every time, uh, I gotta push it down. And it still, see it moves up and it's all lanky. Do you see that? You're just gonna take this and put it through the top. And then you tie it, you put it on, that's basically it. All right, so then you got your wrist cut. These are the wrist cut. Now for the rest of this, I'm a little shocked about the one thing inside. So as per usual, with any cheap hanfu, I realize they give you a hairpin and some ribbon. I mean, and the thing is, if you saw the picture I had, her, her hair is not, her ribbon look a lot better than mine. Why am I look like from Dollar Tree? We having an issue here. I am not a pint-sized fairy. This is not right. Oh, that's cute. So they tried to keep the scent into the outfit. I'm gonna move on to the clip that you'll see I inserted in a moment of me after I've dried it and washed it, what it looks like on me. Let go ahead and roll the clip.
Hey guys, so I tried on the Hanfu. It looks great. It feels great. I will say the pros and cons. I'm sorry if I don't sound as loud as I want. I'm gonna be honest. I'm doing this B-roll and I just finished it. It's two in the morning. And uh, I don't wanna wake my neighbors. For the pros, I love the way it feels and how easy it was to put on and how the detailing, girl or boy, whichever you identify with, even unisex or, you know, not gender conforming. Anyway, I think this looks great. I like it a lot. I believe this outfit is unisex because they they're starting to do a lot of couple outfits, but I like it personally because it can be worn as unisex. It came with these arm guards and it came with one of these. The other one came with my other Hanfu that I bought. I just decided to stick them both in here. Put up the ribbon in the back. It does feel really easy and simple. It doesn't feel too thick. Even though some people might feel like, oh, it's a costumey design. But it's kind of thick enough to where you can wear it outside and it's not like too overly shiny. It does look a bit like unrealistic, but not as much to where you're like, what is this? Ones, I would definitely say for me, there's an opening right between my these pants. And I did put it on correctly with the hold. It just feels kind of weird. I would say wear in either a certain pants layer or skirt layer underneath it. Even though the price was cheap for it, and I know people are like, oh, the fabric's cheap, and that's what makes the price cheap. Well, yes and no, because there's also other fabrics that are like that too, but you still need your anchor layers as well. It looks really good for its embroidery, but you can tell it was like kind of quickly done and thrown off. Hanfu is more more elegant with their embroidery. They make it stand out. They make it known. Even on simple attire, they... But in a way, I feel like they did try their hardest, but it still looks pretty just... It's just like they just copy and paste that. It's hard to critique it because it does look pretty, but it feels kind of plain. Side straps keep getting undone because I just tied this already. I don't like that because I, I literally just tied it it doesn't really match the outfit. I'm pretty half pleased already. I'm gonna give it a C plus, if not a B minus. I know it's not a genuine Hanfu or like a traditional Hanfu from a certain dynasty, but at the same time with all like these cheap, I'm so mad about this room and I'm sorry. Guys, that is what I think of the outfit. It's barely passing, let me just say that. Thank you so much for watching this video. Do not forget to hit the like video if you like unboxing videos like these and hit the subscribe button with the bell notification, not only to stay tuned for more videos like these, but also to be notified when I have a new one coming out. If you have a request or a website I should do an unboxing or review on, please leave it in the comments down below. But I'll see you guys later. Bye. Bless me. Out. Yo, I got a lot of booty sweat. This is not cute. I need to have like an air cushion because my butt sweat. It's, I never knew butt sweat was real.